In this video, we are changing the transmission filter on an Allison 2000 series. We will replace it with this double dip spin-on that also fits the 1000 series transmissions. It's recommended to change the filter every 50,000 miles or 24 months, but the fluid every 150,000 miles or 48 months using Dextron 6 synthetic or TES 295 synthetic Allison approved fluid. Okay, we start by loosening it with a filter wrench. And screw it by hand a few more turns to let the excess oil drip into a pan. This does get a little bit messy. Once the dripping goes down, we finish unscrewing it. Make sure to locate the magnet in the shape of a washer. It's either on the filter housing or stuck on the filter. We take it off and clean it well so it can be reused with the new filter. Center it on the new filter. And after lubing the gasket and filling the filter with transmission fluid, we slowly screw it on making sure it's not cross-threading. Once the filter makes full contact with the gasket, tighten it by hand a full turn. We empty the oil from the filter in a clean pan and notice some dirt but no metal shavings, which is a good sign. The best way to tell is using a magnet if you have to. After driving a few miles, we check the fluid while the engine is still idling and after checking the dipstick, we add about a pint. Now, keeping up with changing this filter as instructed will help ensure clean oil flow through the transmission and keep the shifting solenoids working properly and in turn, this will ensure it's smooth shifting. And that's about it. Well, thank you for watching. I hope this video helped you along the way. And if you have any questions, feel free to ask in the comments. See the description for links of tools and materials used in this video. And you all have a great day.